hi guys welcome back to my channel thank you all for stopping by today i'm going to show you how i make my caribbean style fried chicken to get started i have some lake quarters which i cut in half and i wash them up thoroughly in some lemon juice i'll be using some fresh green seasoning and some corona beer and for the dry seasonings i have some bouillon all-purpose seasoning salt some chicken seasoning paprika garlic powder and black pepper so basically what I did was added all of my dry seasoning to the chicken and then I added about a quarter cup of fresh green seasoning. I will leave the recipe to the green seasoning down in my description box. Then I added about a half of that Corona beer. Now I usually use Banks beer for this but it's not usually found where I am in the US so I'm substituting with Corona beer. But if you're from Guyana you can use Banks beer. If you're from Trinidad you can use Carib or Stag. If you're from Jamaica you can use red stripe now once the chicken is well coated with the ingredients we will cover and allow it to marinate overnight tomorrow I'll show you guys the next step so for the breading I'm using self rising flour if you don't have self rising flour you can use flour and baking powder I have here some all-purpose garlic and onion powder, salt and black pepper. I mix the combine and this is what I'll coat my chicken in. So you want to go ahead and just coat your chicken generously with the mixture, shake off the excess and place it onto your, you know, uh, dish or whatever you want to place it on. And we'll continue with this process until we're done. Then we'll allow them to rest for about 15 minutes just to absorb the flour while we preheat our oil to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Now into my preheated oil, I will add my chicken legs first because they're all the same size. So that means they'll be done cooking at the same time. So we'll cook them for about, let's say 12 to 15 minutes or so. These chicken are, they're pretty small. So, you know, they don't need to cook like super, super long. So once it's done, you wanna just remove them and go in with the chicken thighs next. We will cook these up until they're nice and golden brown and cook all the way through. And then, yeah, that's basically it. That's how I make my Caribbean style fried chicken. When I tell you this is amazing, the chicken was so juicy, tender and flavorful. It was marinating overnight. So you guys know how delicious this was. I can't wait for you all to try this recipe. And here you have it, my version of Caribbean style fried chicken. This was my go-to way to fry chicken when I lived in Guyana. It was so delicious and it still is and I can't wait for you all to give it a try. If you enjoy my video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, share it and leave a comment down below. I will leave all the ingredients and measurements down in the description box and I'll see you all next time. Thank you for watching. I appreciate your support and as always, enjoy.